Answering the questions of GDH Digital at Technofest 2022, Baker Technology Technical Manager Selchik Bayraktar informed that despite the war, Ukraine continues to deliver the engines for the Kazilelma Combat Unmanned Aircraft System. It is planned to use Ukrainian origin AI-25 TLT and AI-322F turbofan engines in Kazilelma. There will be three different engine options, one AI-25 TLT, AI-322F or two AI-322F for different needs. A contract was signed with Ukraine for the supply of engines for Kazilelma. It can be evaluated that the AI-25 TLT without afterburner developed over the AI-25 teraliters, which is used in L-39 Albatross trainer aircraft and can give approximately 16.9 knots of thrust, will have this thrust value at least. It is more likely to be used as a first phase motor due to its low cost, simplicity and thrust. The second engine option, the AI-322F with afterburner, will be a much more compatible option for an aircraft with aggressive flight characteristics like the Kazilelma. AI-322F, it can produce a maximum thrust of 24.5 knots without afterburner, 44.1 knots with afterburners and can operate up to Mach 1.6. The AI-322 is currently used in twin-engine Hongdu L-15 light attack aircraft. Alongside the single-engine configurations, there will be a twin-engine configuration equipped with two AI-322Fs for red. Due to the higher thrust of the twin-engine configuration, it is likely to have a larger fuselage for greater internal weapon station volume and fuel capacity. The twin-engine Kazilelma, which will be able to reach higher speeds and have a wider combat radius, will also have advantages in terms of survivability as it can continue to fly if one engine fails and the other engine works. Announced by Tay on June 10, 2022, TF-6000, which can give 26.7 knots and 44.5 knots thrust with afterburner, has similar thrust values with its AI-322F turbofan engine with afterburner. The use of TF-6000 on MUS is on the agenda. Bayraktar Kazilelma will operate at a cruising speed close to the speed of sound. In the next process, it will be able to exceed the speed of sound. Kazilelma will have an ammunition and payload capacity of close to 1.5 tons. It will be able to carry air-air, air-ground -air, air smart missiles and cruise missiles. The radar will be able to carry its ammunition inside the hull so that it has a low visible design. In missions where radar invisibility is not at the forefront, ammunition will also be under the wing. Below the Kazilelma exhibited with the ammunition planned to be used on it at Technofest 2022, Gokdoan Beyond Vision Air Air Missile, Bozdoan In Sight Air Air Missile, Miniature Bomb, Miniature Bomb with IIR Seeker Title, exhibited for the first time at IDEF 21, UPS-82 Guidance Kit, Lysin Guidance Kit, SOM Cruise Missile took place. Bayraktar Kazilelma will be able to land on short runway ships with the help of catch cables and hooks. The element that distinguishes the aircraft design from other unmanned warplanes in the world is its vertical tails and front canard horizontal control surfaces. Thanks to these control surfaces, it will have aggressive maneuverability. It will also bring with it a low stall speed thanks to its high wing area relative to its weight. The low stall speed will also play a major role in Kizilma ability to take off from short runway vessels.